Okay, so it's time for another King's Treasures. This will probably, yeah, this will be the last one for August. September has some good stuff coming out, but I got some good stuff recently, so I thought I'd show it. <laughs> All right, and I have no idea why my hands were like that in the beginning. So, um, a couple of things I want to mention um, that I can't show are. Um, I bought the Street Fighter game for PS3. For those of you who are on my PlayStation Network, you can play against me. Um, actually, yeah, that's about it <laughs> for things I can't show. Uh, first off, um, today I went to Borders and they were uh, closing down, so I got a lot of um, books half price. I got a Spy vs. Spy. This is actually a small one. Let's produce my hand about the size of a manga. It's actually pretty cool. Only six bucks, half price. I love Spy vs. Spy. I bought the two giant books that they made. I don't know if there's any more than these. Um, I got the two that they had. Yeah, Spy vs. Spy. Not much to say. Two spies killing each other. Great stuff. <laughs> it's pretty funny. Um, I also bought the uh, Chuck Norris books. Um, they're just, uh, basically three, or four, if you count this one, this makes the entire set. This is a box set, which has the first three. The Truth. Actually, this is the third one, so I have them out of order. Whoops. The Truth About Chuck Norris. Chuck Norris versus Mr. T. And Chuck Norris cannot be stopped. And The Last Stand of Chuck Norris. All four books. They're basically books that have Chuck Norris jokes. These are absolutely hilarious if you like those Chuck Norris jokes. Like, um, I'll give you two. I don't know if these are in the books. I have not read these yet. But I have heard Chuck Norris jokes from people. Like, Chuck Norris is the only man who can slam a revolving door. Jesus walks on water. Chuck Norris swims through land. Stuff like that. If you find that stuff funny, you'll obviously love these books. Um, I will mention that in these books, they sometimes have pictures, which, um, in my opinion, make the jokes even funnier. Chuck Norris. He's unstoppable. Next up is DVDs I got. Yeah, all that, by the way, all these, was only like 30 bucks. And that's amazing, considering they say I saved 47 Next up, Lost Boys Movie Collection. I have not seen either movie. I know, gasp. So, I decided to get it. Um, a lot of friends of mine said they love the Lost Boys. Corey Feldman. And so, I decided to get it. Um, I'll most likely do a review on this. Like I said, I'm going to be doing um, Halloween and horror movie things like this. Reviews around Halloween. So, look for that review around then. I don't know what I'll add with it, because I'm not really... I don't have a lot of vampire movies, so that's good. Next up is Boy Meets World. I bought seasons um, 5 and 6, meaning in September... Or, no, October, I can get the last one, and I'll have the entire series. I just love the old 90s shows. And not much to say about them, except for, um, spoilers if you have not seen this show. This one goes up to when they graduate, and Topanga asks Corey to marry her. And this one ends where Topanga's uh, parents are getting divorced, and she feels like she doesn't want to get married anymore. And the last one will have the marriage, of course. Then I got, uh, two Bleach box sets for the, um... Bounce Saga. Yes, I know this is filler, but hey, I left off there, so I continue there. Has four discs in the first one, containing, um, uh, let me look at the box, actually, containing 16 episodes, 16 uncut episodes. Good stuff, not much to say there. Other than that, um, next one up, part two, only containing 12 episodes. 
again. Uh, each one has about four episodes on the back. So I have up to episode 91 now. I will be getting more bleach soon. I know these are incredibly old. Uh, I'm sure they're up to the Iran car, probably even past that now. I don't even know if they show this on Cartoon Network anymore, but... Yeah, so my opinion, uh, these I actually got for good price, by the way. Um, I went to Fry's, and they will match prices offline. So just tell them to look up Amazon or even Walmart, and you can get them for a good 20, 20 bucks, 25 bucks tops. Uh, this one, also Fry's, this was only $7.99. It has both Lost Boys movies. As for these two, uh, Amazon got them each for only 20 bucks, $19 each. And I already explained how I got these so cheap through borders in Simi Valley, California. They're going to close real soon. If you live in that area, go get your hands on some books. I could have bought manga. Now, that's probably going on everybody's mind right now. Well, he's an anime fan. Why didn't he get manga? That's simple. Amazon can beat borders. Even when they're closing, they can beat borders. I've actually seen some manga on sale through sellers for a damn penny, meaning you only have to pay for the shipping. Why I haven't bought them? I'm just lazy. <laughs> so, or the, the person, the seller is too far away, so I'm kind of iffy on people who live in another state. I don't know. That's just me. You don't have to be like me. You can go ahead and buy them off there if you want. I probably will eventually buy some manga off of there. I mean, I buy a uh, brand new manga off of there. Like, I'm going to get Naruto in about two weeks. And, uh, two weeks? Week? Two weeks. I think. I don't know. <laughs> Who knows with Viz? Viz, it can be whenever the hell they want. Yeah, but this is all the stuff for the end of August that I bought. And next month will be new stuff. Um, this is all pretty much stuff that's been around, but I got my hands on. So, look forward to next month when I get my hands on a few things. One, I will announce right now, I'm getting Star Wars on Blu-ray. That is an absolute must-have. Um, other stuff, I'll just leave it up to you to think what I might get. So, that's the end of this video, and have a nice day. Well, it's not day. It's night. Have a nice night. <laughs>